Welcome back to the channel guys. Uh, Jeff here at Titan FPV. I got a quick update for you. Uh, many of you may have been interested, me including, in the Fat Shark Shark Bite uh, HD system. I was on one of the uh, Facebook uh, FPV groups and I noticed somebody posted a link. Looks like FPV has the system in stock currently as of time of this video. Um, so I know this is uh, an option that a lot of us here have been waiting for, another option to uh, HD uh, FPV other than DJI. Uh, I have the uh, Fat Shark HDO2s, so this would be a, a, you know, a good option for me rather than to have to go out and buy a completely new system. And I can always use my um, Fusion module, TBS Fusion module as well to run analog. Um, so we'll go over a couple quick things here. This is going to be coming new to the channel. I've already placed it on order, but I just want to get this video out really quickly there for you guys. So the system looks like it includes the uh, DVR, uh, the uh, video receiver, an all-in-one, uh, and it includes a 20x20 20 20, uh, VTX along with the RunCam HD camera. Now, unlike the original, um, system that Fat Shark offered the um, Bifrost system this is actually um, going to have a 20 by 20 VTX and the camera is going to be a uh, actually an HD it's not analog uh, camera there that's running at uh, HD uh, resolution so this is going to be a 720 uh, 660 FPS system there um, it's going to have a built-in uh, DVR with the uh, receiver there. So, um, really excited. And another guy posted a video earlier, I noticed today, of a Whoop VTX that's coming. So, uh, the Whoop VTX is, I believe, only going to do up to 300 milliwatts. Um, the 20 by 20 that's included in this system is going to be um, 500 milliwatts. Uh, you should be able to fly this along with your analog friends, so uh, they're doubting or, or boasting uh, compatibility there with uh, analog existing systems. So this will be coming to the channel soon, guys. I'll probably be putting this in a 5-inch build. I've got a uh, Armitan uh, Rooster build, so instead of going with the analog, I'm going to put this system in there, and then, of course, We'll have some whoop and toothpick builds with this as those uh, VTX drop later. Now, uh, as it is now, it's kind of an all-in-one system. Looks like it's $249 on GetFPV. Um, it's going to come with the receiver, the 20x20 with an MMCX VTX, and the camera as long as the uh, wiring and mounting hardware. So, just a quick update video, guys. Uh, I know a lot of us have been waiting on this. I want to thank you again for checking in there, and we'll catch you in the next one.